<coughs> hey guys, Sid here with another Minecraft video. Today we're going to be taking a look at my uh, my design for a stone generator. Um, as you can see, I've pretty much gone with a uh, the design based off my cobblestone generator. Uh, if you have not seen that, a link will be in the description, or you can look over look over there. But yeah, uh, the link will per will will have a tutorial. So yeah, break that. Lava comes down, and it generates sand. I mean stone, not sand. Um, yes, this. Uh, this generator is especially good if you're terraforming and you don't want to uh, go down and use a silk pickaxe to uh, get all kinds of stone and then you have to worry about filling in the area or lighting it up so mobs don't spawn. And also you have to worry about uh, mobs spawning and killing you, like maybe a creeper. Um, I'm working on a double wide, well, a uh, two line generator. Uh, so far, I'm still having issues with the single line generator, but I have one uh, over there. Um, yeah, the problem is that on the cobblestone generator, there's a torch underneath of this block. Um, with water, you cannot do that. So. It's going to be very hard to figure out a design like that over there, which uh, is 100% uh, accurate and doesn't break itself. Um, this is the design I have now. Uh, I guess I could probably do a quick uh, little demonstration of how I make it. Or I could just show you how to. Yeah. This is so far the only way that I've found to power it. I uh, will self power it and uh, spit out block. Um, sometimes this block right here needs to spaz like that. So, uh, or else it's, it's going to uh, push all the way out. Push all the way out and uh. Oh shit. Great. Alright guys, so I fixed it. I am um, smarter than that made me seem. <laughs> Yeah, so uh, sometimes whenever this is spazzing out, it will push uh, push this out. Well, actually, I've never had it had it happen with the. Uh, hold on. I haven't had that happen with the. Uh, what is comparator? Yeah. Hmm. What if we could do a button with that? Yeah, the button makes it stop. Um, sometimes it automatically stops, but with a repeater there, it sometimes it does just like push it out. But with the comparator there, uh, it doesn't seem to do it. So yeah, let's go ahead and get started with that there tutorial you came for. All right, so first off, we have a block. I mean, not block, but make this design. Um, you're probably going to use cobble or dirt for this. Put water there. <clears throat> and then, um, pretty much do the 
the same thing. And then right here, two. Put your lava. Make sure it works. Good. And then we go on ahead and start powering it. And yeah. an idea for this that I will try out later yeah uh, probably should talk more through this but yeah, you know what I'm putting down alright now this part you gotta do it fast or else the water is going to get out and destroy everything. Uh, let's see. Probably don't need a repeater there. Uh, wait. Yeah. I think that's. This looks different. Right. So hopefully I didn't uh, derp up too much in this tutorial. Hopefully you got it. Um, oh crap. If it does this, uh, you got to like make sure it. You might have to place a block down. Um, Probably want a button there. Uh, get a lever, put it on this block, and then put a piston here. So if you if you need to stop the lava, it's a very easy way. Okay. Let's try to see if that stops. I'm actually still trying to see if it'll break this uh, this comparator because I've been having those issues with a uh, repeater where it breaks the repeater, but it does not break the comparator when it's right there. That's strange. Hmm. All right, so yeah, if uh, if you have any ideas for this, please feel free to comment or uh, send me a message. Or uh, my most desired res response is a video response because I like sending and getting uh, video responses so I can watch what you're doing and see what you're talking about clearly. With comments, you know it's it's text. You don't really uh, you don't really see exactly what somebody's talking about most of the time. So yeah, uh, hopefully this tutorial has helped you um, in any way. Uh, with this, happy terraforming! Uh, I know I'm going to be using this to terraform my home uh, on my survival world. Uh, when I get the chance.